Hey everybody, it's Paul here at <laughs> Shield of Faith Fitness Gym. And I just want to share some thoughts here with you guys, some fitness thoughts to inspire you. I was just thinking about, you know, working out earlier and, and the type of physical pain that you go through when you train, but it's a good pain and how you feel when you're done, how, how good I feel right now. You know, earlier today, I felt like I was in a funk, I felt like I was in a cloud. And I realized I hadn't had my, had my, had my prayer time yet, so I went into my prayer time. I spent time with God. I got in the Word of God. I got my, my faith focus right, and then I come down here, and I got my workout in. And it's like a 360, guys. It's a total night and day difference. So I want to read to you guys here. When you exercise, your body releases chemicals called endorphins. These endorphins interact with the receptors in your brain that reduce your perception of pain. Endorphins also trigger a positive feeling in your body similar to that of similar to that of morphine. Now I've tried to do this video like three times. Text messages coming through calling. So I'm gonna try again. Hope I don't get interrupted here as I'm making this inspirational video for you guys. So do listen guys, here it is. Just you got to take care of yourself. I'm let me tell you something right now. I have a home gym and I have obviously my gyms. And I'll work out at my home gym, and then I'll come here. And I'm gonna tell you something, it's a night and day difference. When you're at home, you, you got your, you know, you got your laundry going, you got, you got the kitchen there, you got your bill sitting on the counter, you got all these distractions, all these things that just distract you and keep you away from getting the full benefit of your workout. But when I come to, a, to the gym, it's an atmosphere that's created for one thing, for you to exercise and to work out. My workouts are night and day. And I know a lot of y'all last year, because of fear, have, have hidden away in your, in your garages or you got your little home gyms. I'm telling you, that's gonna wear out. I'm telling you right now, I've done home gyms before in the past. I've done it twice in my life, and it, it's not the same as getting into the atmosphere of a gym. It's, it's just the way it is, folks. It's a created atmosphere to, to get you motivated. You get better workouts. Your mind is clear. You don't have any distractions. The phone's not ringing unless you obviously you got your cell phone, but you don't have anything bothering you. You don't hear the dryer go off. Oh crap, or the washer, I gotta throw that in the dryer, and you skip a set or whatever you do. The gym is where it's at, guys. Stop living in fear. I'm telling you right now, this will fix you. It is it has fixed me. It's, it helps me in my life. Anybody who follows my, my ministry, my YouTube channel, guys, it's real and raw who I am. And everything about me is, is right there for people to look at and see what my life is about. And my life has always been about, number one, my faith in God and my relationship with Christ and staying, staying with his word. And number two, taking care of this body and this temple and doing things the right way. So if you eat right, exercise, weight training, your body gets those endorphins, it gets those positive feelings. I start to feel better. I feel energized. I feel like I can take on the world. That's what it does for you guys. So one of my sayings also for this year for me is called flex and flow. Flexibility and blood flow. It's crucial, guys. I've been focusing more lately on my flexibility, on my stretching, on my goskus, and obviously my weight training is all about blood flow, high reps, low weight, just getting blood flow to my muscle. You know, I, don't, I just did squats earlier, low weights, got deep squats. Man, my, my glutes are on fire. My glutes and my quads have grown bigger in the last couple of years by lifting this way, training this way versus that heavy weight, breaking down your joints, breaking your back down, breaking your body down, making the point where you don't want to work out, you skip workouts. Hey, how it goes, guys. I, tr I can run circles around most guys my age group because I train smart, and I'm encouraging you train smart, train for health, train for longevity, and your body will get back to you, and you'll age gracefully. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. So I'll be 45 here in a few months, and uh, by the grace of God, I, I was working out here at the gym, and I said, Lord, thank you so much. Doing my squats, I said, man, just thank you. We got the paint job done. You know, I work out at the house. Like I said, I got my home gym. Sometimes I just want to be there, but it's like I never get the same feeling. I never get that same workout I get to when I come to the gym. And I was here tonight, here to, earlier this afternoon just thinking, Lord, thank you so much for this. It's a blessing, guys. Take advantage of it. Get in the gym. Be committed, and your body will get back to you. And don't just come in here and do a couple stretches and a couple exercises and leave. That's not a workout, guys. Do a whole body workout or break it up in different muscle groups or different days. Give your body that chance that it can give back to you, okay? All right, guys. Everybody, God bless. And something exciting, we got a promotion coming. Uh, me and my son will be making a, uh, our own like a little commercial between, the boat team, between both the gyms. We're excited about that. Um, we're going to be reaching out to our, our, our young athletes. We got some great ideas uh, as we created this this color scheme of the of the school systems for each school. 
The athletic directors have been awesome to us. There's a good positive energy going between both both communities. We're looking forward to that. We're looking at dipping into the, to the positive mentality of people who just want to make it make a change in their life. That's what we're focusing on. Those people who just want to just want to take advantage of it and just be a part of something positive and something good. That's what this has always been. The slogan has been from day one is think positive. That's what it's about. When you got time for whiners, negativity, and all that complaining and looking for just looking for something to, to complain about, nitpick about. There's enough things in life, folks. We've been through, life in itself is hard enough as it is to go picking apart the things, the little blessings that you're given. So let's have a positive attitude going into this year. I'm on fire right now. I just busted out a workout at the gym. I feel good. Flo flex and flow, guys. Flex and flow. Get that get that resistance training in. Burn the muscles out, man. Get them endorphins releasing through your system, and you'll feel so much better. I'm telling you. All right, guys. Peace out. God bless, and we'll see you soon.